uh, color and black and white in the same image. Uh, this is a portrait that's been HDR that we'll be doing later in the year. I'm in Photoshop. Uh, over here is the layers palette. I want to duplicate the layer. And that gives me two layers. I'm also now going to go Control Z to undo it. I'm going to go to the adjustment layer and down here it says color black and white and what it's done is it's created a new layer and it's placed the image up here in black and white if I go to these different carrots anything that's red in the picture will adjust and it's yellow and what you don't want is to go too dark or too bright because you get digital noise and what you're looking to do is uh, just create contrast. Now, there are no greens in this picture. Let's see if there are any light blues. Yep, Superman has light blue and maybe dark blue. Yep. So you can do some minor adjustments there. At that point, here's our friend the mask. We touch on the mask. We're in black and white we can get rid of this. We go to the paintbrush. Uh, I want edges that are going to be sharp and not soft. And I, I can adjust the uh, paint brush. By going smaller or bigger. And I'm on the mask, and wherever I paint will come in color. So if I come, and there it is right there, if I come over here and turn this off, that's the full color image. So this is masking, it's called non destructive. And you can choose what you want black and white in color. You may want to magnify this. And you could take the uh, polygonal tool and if you put this on white in the uh, foreground and hit delete it will delete it and hit control D and it gives you a nice crisp edge. So this would take me a little bit of time to go through it and I just wanted you to get the technique on it. See I'm going wide here. It's important to magnify it. Control D deselects it if I hit Command minus. And you can see the image I'm setting up. Um, if I go to the paintbrush, it's taking it away. So I'll put that black foreground color. And I'm going to do it really fast so you can get started. You'll be more precise than I am. Because if you enter this in a competition, they get blown up. And if you get any areas that uh, are being changed, like if I got a little bit of his hand, I may not see it at this magnification, but when you blow it up, you would definitely see it. I just want to give you the idea of this assignment. That's pretty good. Hit the F key so it highlights it. And that's Colonel Sanders, played by Mr. Wheeler. And that's it. Okay. So have fun. So we don't need to duplicate the layer. We now have adjustment layers. And you go down here, and it says black and white, and that's what you hit. Okay. Have fun.